This has been the Perimeter Transportation pregame show. Perimeter Transportation is the official carrier of your Chilliwack Chief. McGilvery has it. And now ahead for Mateo Mercik over the Nanaimo line. Here's a chance moving in on goal. Moran shoots and he sails it high over top. <laughs> by the Clippers, Michael Craig. The captain will knock it back in. It's caught out of midair by Austin McNicholas. He's going to hang on as falling into the crease mouth. <laughs> To the line held in by Daniels and now here's Hewitt moving in cutting to middle ice Hewitt holding now in front here's a shot it's angled away and, and now here's Hewitt moving in cutting to middle ice Hewitt holding now in front here's a shot it's angled away and it's here for Nanaimo a backdoor play again just missed the tap in there Charles Tardiff Cameron swings it to the right side. There's another wrist shot. It's stopped there by McNicholas. Interesting to make a save there was Austin McNicholas. Second shot of the game registered for the Clippers. Here's McGilvery down low. Here's Mercer driving to the goal. Fires a shot. Still no score. Clippers and Chiefs. Sasha Teleguin forcing the issue. Here's Grabis. Backhander stopped by Aiden Campbell. And he's going to risk again as a saucer one down the ice. And this time he'll get the call on the icing and we've seen that three times this period Tyler just has left here in this first period now Teleguin on the fly stick handling through center over the Nanaimo line Teleguin fires a shot stopped by Campbell and he'll hang on shot just to kind of relieve some pressure and get a change in. Yeah, and the other two came from Nick Nicholas's right, and he kind of wore them both on the shoulder. They're a bad angle shot, so yeah, not much going on in the shot category for Nanaimo. I thought out of those 13 shots, it was maybe three, maybe four good quality scoring chances for Chilwack. McKinnis pinches from the blue line, drives the goal. McKinnis to the front, comes back for Feenan now. He'll throw it on goal, and it's caught by Campbell who hangs on. Campbell stands at the top of that list and he's got 17 to go on top of that as well here tonight. 50-50 puck, look who it is, Hewitt right in front and he was off now by Kinch and he'll go the other way for Chilliwack. Dylan Kinch dropping it off, Weeb fires the shot, scores! Oh the captain locks, loads and rips it over the right shoulder of Aiden Campbell. Chilliwack's open the scoring here, it's 1-0. Oh the quick release. Good job Abram Weeb, smart jumps up on the play, it quickly goes from a 3-on-3 three three to a 4-on-3. Nice little drop pass there, Dylan Kinch, Abram Weeb was ready for that. And boy, did he just rip that. What a, that's a next level shot and release right there, Vonnie. Absolute top corner. This is going to be a great angle. Is he goaltender? Campbell, he's out. He's aggressive and challenging. Just can't stop it if you can't see it. Beating him over the right blocker. We do know Abram Weeb's got his 11th of the season. Here's Moran now with a bit of an open ice. Nathan Moran shot stopped and that was bobbled by Campbell. He didn't know where it was. 21st time the Chiefs have opened the game scoring and there's a couple of good saves there by Austin McNip McNicholas. Delayed penalty coming. It looks like it's going to is Nick Sajevic. Dying seconds on the clock as Morse is out of the penalty box in front. And a great chance there for Jake Hewitt is stopped by yeah, Bull you off the face-off win by Chilliwack. Now A.J. Lacroix circling the perimeter. Lacroix to the front of the net, and the puck is found and grabbed by Aiden Campbell again in the second period. 1-0 Chiefs leading. 
Delay lost it. Here's Daniels, shorthanded breakaway for the Clippers. Kai Daniels backhand stopped by McGilvery making moves. Dalton McGilvery down to the goal line. Man out of the box. Here's Lestarza, fires a shot, rebounds loose, and it's smothered by Campbell, who hangs on. Just two shots on that power play for the Chiefs who lead this hockey game 1-0. Here's a shot by Kitch, rebounds loose, wonderful save, not once but twice. On now for Weeb, holding and he couldn't get it to his forehand. Here comes Nanaimo with an odd man rush. Jeremy Payant into Chilliwack territory, shot stopped by McNicholas, who's gonna hang on. After two periods of play this year, are 14-1-0-1. The Clippers, when trailing after two, are 1-6-1. and Got Brian Morse, and the Chiefs go the other way. Here's Grabis for the Chiefs behind the Clipper defense. Grabis on goal, stopped by Aiden Campbell. Teleguin in front, looking for Davidson. Grabis shoots, he scores! A short angle. I'm very interested to well, see the, what it it's is. Got to be, go. It's got to be looking close. There it is. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> well, there it is. They called the goal on the ice, so you got to make you, the call on the ice. You, you said it's got to be conclusive, Vonnie, and, and it wasn't. That was about as tight as it gets, though. But what really what, had the, what the whole point about that, Vonnie, is they have to say that Davison was the reason for the goaltender interference. And on the attack, and now Feenan went to mid-ice, and he was cut off, and here's Payon the other way. Jeremy Payon trying to get behind McInnes, and does. Payon to the front. Glove saved by Austin. Moran knocked off the puck. Now Ethan Mystery trying to shake off McGillery. Finds a shot, scores! Ethan Mystery. A little shake at the blue line. Let's go from distance and through a screen. That's a that's a great job by Mystery. Just very very mobile with the puck at the top of the defensive zone for Chilliwack, and that is just a great shot and a great screen out front. But thought, that, Mor thought Moran might have been hooked off the puck there. Yeah, th there's, you, you could have been right. There might be a little case for that. And then you get the weird bounces off of the, the boards as well, too. It didn't really help us in trying to get it on their own zone. But that, that, that's just a good goal by the defender there, a mystery. Walking the line, head up the whole way, and then... Left in four on four play, 11.50 to go here in the third. Chilliwack two, Nanaimo one. Here's a pass, moving in on goal, the shot! Oh, he beat McNicholas, but he couldn't slide it through, and that was Mike Mertens. Pass at the Chilliwack line, and was in behind the defense. Now a wraparound attempt in front, shot, scores! Clippers have come back, it's Kai Daniels. And it's a 2-2 game. Well, just as you thought, okay, we got away with one. As, as Vonnie mentioned, McNicholas was beat on that inside quick deke. And then a little redeflection that goes wide. Kind of, we, we kind of had man on man there as far as four on four. And just a bit of a goal mouth scramble there. Daniels just whacks that one home. Nothing pretty about that goal. Just get as much stick on that puck as you can. Lifts it back to center ice. McGilvery with a nice move. Enters the attacking zone. McGilvery tape to tape pass. Moran shoots, stop, rebound. And it settles on top of the net. Still loose. As that puck popped free, Campbell was down and out. Now it's McGilvery again, shot stop, rebound. Oh, how did they miss that? Not sure how they missed that opportunity. Here they come though again. Here's Mateo Mercik moves in with McGilvery in front, shot stop, rebound again. My goodness, they just can't get it to go. I'd say the same thing if we had the man advantage. I'd say that's tough. The Clippers win the faceoff. Here's Michael Craig, top of the left circle, down to the goal line. In front, Sejevic in front, shoot, scores. There's a power play goal for Nanaimo. It just took 11 AJ through center over the Nanaimo line, drops it off. Mason Kesselring shoots, he scores! Oh, what a rocket by Kesselring, and this game's tied it. Lost it to Beaulieu ahead now. Here's Mercik, maybe a two-on-one for Chilliwack. Mateo Mercik with Nico Grabis, fires, stop. Oh, it just rolled past. Uh,
Wax Zone. Lestarza into Nanaimo Ice. He's going to leave it for Abram Weeb. Weeb now for the trailer. Bull, you shoot. Stop by Campbell and hangs on. Head now for A.J. Lacroix. Over the Nanaimo line. Lacroix curls. Pass was behind Weeb. Now he's going to have to hurry to recover, and he does. Pushed off there by Payant. Stolen by Hewitt. Hewitt overskated it. Turns, fire shot. Rebound. Payant scores. Oh, a turnover in front of the Chilliwack goaltender, Austin McNicholas. Jeremy Payant is Johnny on the spot. And the Chiefs have lost in overtime for the first time this season. Clippers with the overtime winner, Jeremy Payant, have defeated Chilliwack 4-3 in sudden death. We'll take a break and come back with a summary after this on Produce Gone Wild Chiefs Hockey. Thank you. 